Hello everyone and welcome back for another episode of Divinity Original Sin. In the last episode we found Counselor Jake, now an unfortunate zombie corpse. Um, the plot has thickened significantly. Uh, we're going to be carrying on and, uh, well, uh, pushing forwards with the main storyline. So give me a second and I'll jump into game with Matrix. I don't know if you remember what happened at the end of the last episode. Um, we found Counselor Jake, didn't we? Yes, Zombie Jake and we killed Evelyn. And then we called an end to it immediately. Like, so we haven't even gone and round and looted this room yet. Have we? I it think I might have. I, I might have looted the room. There's a jawless skull over here. <laughs> You're not going near the rack. Well, she won't. Even though she was quite happy to get on one of the other ones. I think it's because you went on the other one before. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just healing myself up by walking near these torture devices and drinking the blood off the floor because that's delicious. Thing. Ooh! I found nothing oh, in that. Found... <laughs> yes, combat log says otherwise. <laughs> combat log? There's no combat going on here. All right, let's identify that and we'll see. Uh, <laughs> There's a combat inside your head about whether or not you should tell me about the loot you've just picked up. Oh, I'm going to send this to you. Winding Scimitar of Vitality, that sounds kind of cool. That's alright. It's not great, truth be told. I mean, it's very fast, but it's still not great. So, thanks, but I'm just going to sell it later. <laughs> thanks, but... Ah, don't sit on that chair. What, the, the couch? I, I think that chair is basically bum spikes. Ah, oh, no. Back back of the head spikes. That yes. one's fine. C come sit on this chair. It's lovely. I try it, It's a rack. You it's can not a rack. You can, you can actually see it's a torture chair. Why would you sit it on it? <laughs> it's great. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Eat of paper. You know, there doesn't actually appear to be anything more to do in here. Now no. That we've, uh, so looted everything. A little bit surprising, but uh, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm just having a quick look around for any switches that might. I did be... get some uh, some books that I'm just going to have a quick look. No, so send that to Maddie. Send that to Maddie. I'm not seeing any switches on the walls, so I don't think there's any secrets that we've missed. Let's combine this with... where's that? Is that going to work? No. Okay, so yeah, I, I think the shocking twist was our discovery that Evelyn actually didn't murder Jake, but she brought him back to life. Yes, so not... Does that count? Can we still, like, have her arrested anyway for, for being in have, league with what, ha, evil? Ha, have, have this have this dead body. I mean, she's, she's dead here. We can't arrest her. She's dead. It's a good point. But I suppose we should, tell... we should, yeah, at least free the, uh, the person that we did lock up. Ah, uh, yeah, that's, wait, no, she, uh, do we even know who murdered Jake? Was Jake even murdered? No, Jake. Jake was like accidentally killed. Yeah, I think. Well, Hang let's on. head. Let's head back to Sci Seal. Um, yes. Okay. Probably North Gate. Yeah, that's Central that's where I'm point. going in. It. Oh, Ahu. Oh, hello, Ahu. So, I reckon uh, he Ahu, knew all be along. Before we talk about any of this stuff. Uh, going to sell you a bunch of things. That's hey, right. here's some stuff that I took off dead Counselor Jake. What tipped you off to the fact that I found him? Yeah. Yeah, that's that's probably good. Now, what stuff's he got? Uh, Pyrokinesis stuff and Geomancer stuff. Don't care about that. That's interesting. Uh, not very useful. This is also not very useful. That's technically slightly better, but no, I can't be bothered to buy it. 
That'll probably do, actually. Let's uh, just even that up. Okay. So I have. Let me get you up to speed. Dot, dot, dot. Oh, good. It doesn't go through the whole yeah. thing. Dark turn of events. This is worse than my deepest fears made manifest. Wait. So we could have just come to him and said, Hey, Bracus Rex. Yeah, we didn't really have any proof though at that point. No. Forgive me, this news just so this thing. It was the king of tyrants. The embodiment of terror. The lunatics that seek his rise must be stopped, whatever the cost. I wonder if he uh, helped yes, to Dark stop. Shadow. We really, really are twins. Yeah. If you get rid of his facial hair. Then uh, I, I look like him. That's that's the way things usually work. I mean, obviously, if you change the purple hair to normal color, make it shortish. Yeah. Of course, we uh, need anyway, to pull the I, same facial expression. Yeah, yeah. Hey, <laughs> welcome there, Sheldo. Good to have you on the stream. I, I do. I do indeed. He talks really slowly. Mm. Of demons in sheer perfidy and malice, given half a chance. I don't know what perfidy means. Uh, answers on a postcard, people. once more is unthinkable. The possibility of his return is more than I can bear. And Ikara, the white witch. She has been <laughs> yes. into this sorry business adds insult to insufferable injury. There have long been rumours that Bracus's corpse was interred in the vaults beneath the abandoned Church of the Seven. In I wonder which church that is! Yeah, we found the vault already, we just couldn't get in. Yeah. That place is crawling with undead these days, so the rumours may well be true. Where Leandra goes, the dead rise left and right. And even in death, the long-lost tyrant's corruption appears to persist. Well, the thing about a dead necromancer is you kind of expect their power to persist after death. I yeah. Mean, that's kind of their it's whole a, domain. It's a bit like becoming a light. It's, you know, it makes you stronger. Cassandra. Why does Ahu care about a person that no one's mentioned in this game yet? It's nothing, Hunter. Nothing. My mind is reeling, but I... I'll feel better soon. After you've cut short Leandra's dark pursuits. So, um, we saw a leader of this cult. Yeah. yeah. I know her, though I haven't seen He's already mentioned her once. As you know, yeah. she and Ikara are sisters. It's hard for me to believe that she's leading this cult. That she's delirious enough to go after Bracchus Rex. But clearly her involvement can no longer be denied. Well, yes, I mean, you've got witnesses, four, four witnesses that survived an encounter with no other witnesses, and we all say the same story. Yes. <laughs> totally she not suspicious. As as ten wizards put together, Hunter. An opponent to be feared. It's a good job I'm not a wizard. <laughs> yeah, this time. <laughs> Jake and Evelyn called her the conduit, didn't you? In that case, yes. she may just be the elusive head of the Immaculates. There's a village in the forests north of Sysiel where a new religion has taken hold. I think we found that way into the forest, didn't we? Immaculate. Yeah, we decided not to go that way yet. They worship a leader called the Conduit. This village is called Silverglen. And if my suspicions turn out to be correct, there is sorcery at work there. Okay. Alas, I haven't the foggiest. Another sorcerer, perhaps? Or simply another victim of Leandra's ploys. The Legion didn't find a second body at the scene of the crime. So maybe he escaped with his life after all. Though, just as likely, his body too was taken away by Evelyn for experimentation. Mm, yes. Sounds likely. So why does he bemoan Ikara's involvement in all she of this? She's a great woman hunter. A champion of all that is good and pure. A great woman hunter. She may have killed Jake, but then again... The man turned out to be a vile sorcerer. I can only surmise that she is on to her sister's sinister schemes, which makes me fear for her safety more than anything else. Well, well. I guess let's go find the witch and protect the witch. 
that seems like a really weird thing to be saying. Air quotes protect. Good evening there, Royal Nick. Good having you on the stream. Please pursue Leandra to the old church in the east and stop her before she can raise Brachus. I beg of you. Uh, Ahu, I don't suppose you've got a hexagonal medallion, do you? Like bringing up Brachus Rex's name alone is enough to turn our friendly neighborhood wizard into a scary cat. I wonder why this ancient specter spoons And so the mystery is solved. Councillor Jake was murdered by this so-called white witch. Mm. But as it stands, I guess our next concern is Brachus Rex. <laughs> we did what we set out to do. <laughs> Nowhere in our orders is the hunt for an undead king mentioned. Uh, yes, uh, Alex has no ability to stream Divinity, um, so he recommends people come over to my channel uh, for the duration. Uh, he'll be back up when it's Diablo 3 a bit later. Um, yeah, it's the moment, unfortunate, but... Uh, it, you just have to listen to him via me. You don't get my lovely face, in, <laughs> instead you just have my uh, my dulcet tones. Oh, what? Get cautious? Yeah, you said... I don't want to go after an undead king because I'm terrified. Well, not because I'm terrified, because I want more money. It's pretty much you said you're terrified. Right, so I'm cautious and bold. I've got even on both of them now. Uh, if you've got cautious, your sneaking's increased by one. If you've got bold, your initiative is increased by one. I'll take either of those, but neither? Boo. So what do you think? Uh, should we go to the church first or should we go to the woodland area? Um, I think we should probably go to the church first, just in case there's something new happened there. And it'll only take us a second to so then get over. to the Sil Silver Glen Road. Yeah, they're right next to each other. All right, Silver Glen Road, you say? No, Old Church. Ah, Silver Glen Road uh, is not far away, but uh, yes. Old Church first. Uh, Royal Nick uh, passes on his regards, by the way. Ah, good, good. Uh, we will be, of course, playing Diablo a little bit later and uh, and carrying on with that. But for now, the RPG of Swords and Sorcery. Uh, this is not actually Swords and Sorcery. That is an entirely different game. This is Divinity <laughs> Original Sin. As Matrix you know, said, be yes. Because Swords and Sorcery is an actual RPG, that could be very confusing. <laughs> It's true, it's true. It could be confusing. Let's, um... Ooh, there's a rat that I haven't killed down here. Hey! Oh! You actually got one off him. Tell you're on. Ah! Well, that's why he wasn't in his, um, hut then, I guess. Infected by rot. Unhealable. Perhaps you remember me. A healer. Right. What a He's got a lot of money and another resurrect scroll, so I'm going to grab the resurrect scroll just in case <laughs> things go wrong. Wait, what? Are you going to resurrect him? God no. Uh, let's sell him the cap of life. Song of spirit. I'm going to sell him most of the stuff He's that I have. Describing himself as a herald of death. Uh, don't continue on with the conversation just yet, because I'm going to look at my stats while you're. Okay. Stuff. Uh, no, I need another stat point before I can get dual wielding up again, and the same for two handers. Actually, I need a few more for that. Sell a whole bunch of these. Uh, hmm. Let's sell three magnifying glasses because I only need the one. Uh, yes, I could certainly do with a lot more snacks. Uh, the only trouble is, like, if you're live streaming and trying to eat at the same time, things just don't really work. You end up with a mouth for a food coughing like her. So I try and limit it uh, just, like, between episodes. It's, uh, or easy sad, picking though. things. That can also work. Yeah. But uh... I generally have to keep the food in the other room. Otherwise, I'll just wolf it down while they're talking and then be caught unaware suddenly and have to... Right, let's even that out. There we go. You can continue with the conversation now once you've finished swindling uh, a dying man for all of his cash. 
I've now got 13,700 gold. I think that's just about enough to pay for my way uh, fighting Brachus Rex. Let's have a look and see what he's got that I might want to buy. Oh my god, that is the uh, the worst thing. Let's not buy that. Well, has he got a picture of you? No, <laughs> no, he's got um, uh, Drundene, which I've also got one of, I think. Uh, whereabouts is it? There it is. Uh, eating it gives you minus one dexterity, minus one intelligence, minus one speed, but plus two perception. Ah. Right, let's carry on talking to him. Oh, he summoned something. Oh, he summoned Brachus. All right, what happened here? I've raised a mad king from beyond the grave. Yeah, you're a fool. I imagine so very foolishly. Yeah, let's uh, let's ask questions. Uh, how did you call him forth? Mm-hmm. Double bloodstone? A dripping bloodstone. His powers have all returned. And I cannot stop him. Resurrected, revived. The king lives. Brandon's Why? A dangerous monster. But he achieved things no man or mortal could have dreamt of. How to break a forge of souls? I promise to extract the secret for a woman calling herself the conduit. In exchange, she vowed to the last. Last of my source kings. Began the War of Wars, marching brother against brother, friend, blah, blah, blah. During this, this dark time that your order, the Source Hunters, was formed, Brachus was defeated, and Source out my failures. <laughs> so he's the one that's been raising the undead. So many. I, can hide them no I wonder if he's about to in turn into Brachus. The Source King, I've got the ghoul that guards the lighthouse, the Baron of Bones, the twins by fire joined. Their ghastly faces, undead, source under, unkillable. We killed them. I fear this plague may never end, no matter. Curse her name, her hell. Okay, what can we learn about her? Between her goddess and the world of men. I know. It was she who showed me that bloodstone could be used for more than healing. Her stones, mm. particularly powerful. I've still got one of those unused. <laughs> okay. What could turn any soft soul towards wickedness? The conduit had shown me how to raise skeletons and zombies from the... Ah, oh, Malia. But what I craved was something far more rare. How the conduit's promise seemed simple. A secret for a secret. I'd tell her how to break the soul forge. And you can defeat the unholiness I've raised. You so bet we can. You can save the countless innocents that will perish. Wow. So Celeron believed that by unleashing these monsters, he'd learn the secret to resurrecting his beloved wife. Love so complete can cloud even the best... Romantic. <laughs> Why? You're not romantic. I, in Celeron's position... I am. Oh, forgiving. I I was wrong. All right, let's uh, let's see what that gives. So, forgiving versus vindictive. Forgiving, oh, you're immune vindictive. to cursed. Uh, vindictive, twenty percent uh, attack of opportunities. Well, I am still slightly vindictive. Ah, oh, Brachus Rex is inside. I oh can God. hear him talking. So this is going to be a... Hang on, let me talk to the rat. Come here, rat. You... Why do you have to open the door? Brachus is level 9. Yeah, Alright, hang on. Uh... Okay, if we're going to go, now's the time to go. And it's all going to wear off before the conversation finishes, I'm sure. Oops. I tried to listen in and it started the combat. Sorry. Oh, bollocks. The hell? 
that was <laughs> that was educational, is what that was. Hashtag WTF. Hashtag All of the bosses are here. With hashtag the death by fire. Diedrich the Baron of Bones, the twins joined by fire, and Brackus Rex. Yeah, I have a feeling that that's not supposed to be a thing yet. You know? Well, Let's was was science. it because I accidentally struck it? Maybe. Right, listen. Oh yeah, he seems to quite. He seems to be quite willing to talk. How long has it been? I wonder. My first repose in death. An hour. The time it takes the seas to tear down cliffs. It is a fable I may have become as time dragged on. But he's got a good voice. Hmm. They are one with the force. Yes. A force hunter. A forcerer. Oh, it takes ages to talk. Um, Nick, I don't think this is a boss fight yet. I think... Um, Alex just pissed him off to the point that he alpha struck, killed us. Um, yeah, I think that's a, an educational don't try and bypass the dialogue. Ah, not a thing. There was a woman once that went by that name. Yeah, so I there's a, a Leish called Cassandra. Oh, my sister dearest. Cassandra. <laughs> Man, Man cat. cat. Sounds like a really, really poor superhero duo. They bled, so the reason for my resurrection of simplest of spirits is that I was destined to I like the word vainglorious. It would have been another, perhaps wiser be a woman seeks my secret. For her soul is entwined with another's. Yes. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe he can tell us about the uh, tapestry at the end of time. Maybe. They still smell like you do, by the by. Your brother and sister hunters, as they closed in the <laughs> Oh, amazing. Great dialogue. Yeah. I had but to look at them, and they rusted their chain mail with it. Fountains of gravy. I shall ask that there were too many, as there clearly are too many of you still. Although life renewed has made me rather peckish. And from the looks of you, you need but to mm, delicious. Sounding a bit sordid at this point. Squirt of sauce is sauce. Damn it, he is summoning everyone. Slash insta killing us. Why is he killing me? So, I'm thinking probably we want fire resist before we uh, go into this boss fight. Just at thinking. A, at a bare minimum. Yeah. Man. Mode. Okay, let me have a look and see what kind of spells and things I might have. Because we oh, could always... plenty more side quests yeah. to do before we necessarily go through this door. So... Uh, da -da -da -da. Right, sort this around by type. We've also got, um, potentially, potions as well. Yeah, fire resistance potion is only 15% fire resistance, and it only lasts for a couple of turns. 
which is going to be a case of speed through the conversation really, really quickly. Or I just engage. Uh, but yes, ultimately, it's not that useful. Um, Avatar of Fire makes target immune to burning, but not fire. Fire Absorption Scroll absorbs fire damage until it breaks. Probably wouldn't be that much. We've got two of those, so that could work. How much fire resistance do I have? I've got 24% fire resistance and it still virtually did nothing. Hmm. Maybe we should engage him by... I'm just going to try something. Oh, shooting him from here. Can't see him from this distance. Can you get a little bit closer and start the uh, the dialogue? Oh, do I have to? Have you started the dialogue? No, I am um, in the room. Oh, damn it! That way he's talking with me. That's it. Right, Jason Momoa, bitter cold. Right, started the combat and it didn't freeze him. No, I've ended up uh, covered in poison because <laughs> I'm next to the ghoul that guards the lighthouse. Oh, I got <laughs> dead. I'm going to be dead soon, so that's fine. Right, Medora's turn. First up. Where's that Resurrect Scroll I picked up? Oh no, it's Medora's turn. Medora doesn't have one. Uh, I'll get this block. Let's go to here-ish. Come on. There we go. A lot of poison, but kind of need to do that to get out of it all. Good hit. Now This is going to be explosive. Wrong. There's a chest behind. Chest of the Source King. Yes. So, Resurrect Scroll. Pretty sure I picked one up. Where is it? Sort by type. Maybe I didn't pick one up. <laughs> Maybe it stacks it with ones in white. Yes, it has. Right. There we go. Ah. It's got a limited range. <laughs> of course they do. And you're quite far away. Um, I'm going to focus on trying to kill one of these guys. Just All to right. see if it's possible for the moment. So if I go through that there. No notice the ghoul's name has changed. Ghoul that used to guard the lighthouse, yes. Ah, <laughs> oh, he's on like two health. That is that is pretty funny. Yeah, I should probably start off next to the Baron. Yeah, good one, Medora. Um, I mean, once sure conversations now. engaged with him, we can spread out everyone else so that the initial burst doesn't hit everyone. We just need to be careful about it. Because I was able to engage the conversation and then move with Jason Momoa. Don't, 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 don't! Didn't explode. Only half dead. There we now go. Now very dead. Not Still quite dead. alive. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, once the conversation is engaged, we can definitely split up. Yes. So, who is the most expendable? If... I'm thinking it's Iscario. Right, let's let's heal up first and quick save. Oh. Uh, there's not really a lot to heal up, but okay. So, uh do this on myself. Into the fray once more. 
And also, I'll be able to summon Nick. Yeah. But. Yeah, so if Siscario is the one that goes in and uh, and does the conversation starter. I wonder if I can summon Nick to start the conversation. So I'm in position for the ghoul. I'll go away newly. Okay, this time he's not doing his complete man. Like yes, he, he is. is. I was going to say, but he only hit me a little bit, but he hit me a lot of bit. <laughs> so that that really didn't work. Yeah. I, um, I splintered arrow at him rather than um, engaging in conversation, so that was uh, that was my mistake. Alright, what's Earthall going to do? Focus on the twins or try and focus on the ghoul? I think probably focusing on the twins is the better option. Yeah, I do. I'd be inclined to agree. Nice! Knocked them down! I'm not sure it's really going to help very much, but... I only got three AP left, so let's do this to try and heal up a little bit. Yeah, that's uh, that certainly helped. Earthle's turn again. That's interesting. Not quite intentional. Um, <laughs> Not necessarily better, but... Can't see target, so can't attack. You have to move a bit closer. Still can't see target, and now don't have enough AP to do it. So... It didn't. It didn't look like you moved. That sucks. Um, but uh, what shall I do? No, it can't move. See target, so move further away, so it has to come to you. I guess. Encourage again. Get some more. More health. Yeah. Why not? Hey, that's not cool. If I can't see you, you shouldn't be able to see me. <laughs> this is such a bad combination. Attack of opportunity, but can't see her, so I don't think it, I yeah. Didn't it. Yeah, it didn't do anything. Although it looks like the ghoul's taken some damage. You're fine, Muley. Uh, minor healing potion? Do I have anything bigger? <laughs> don't think I do. Into the fray once more. That seems to be going alright. I drank two of them. <laughs> Four. Right. Um, very low on health as well. Terrible ideas. What can I do? Spinning bird kick. Yeah, pretty much. Knockdown failed. That's bad. Probably going to lose uh, Earthle now. Unless he just misses. Flame breath on the ground. What, what was that? I have no idea. Hang on. Uh, Medora's controlled, I think. No, no, no. Um, uh, Medora being the last person of light. If you lose both major oh, players. Oh, yeah. I see. Okay, let's load again. That was kind of going all right. Yeah. I'll try and split my people up.
Yes. And we'll get rain like, cards first. You can unchain them, don't forget. So yeah. they don't follow each other. Okay, I've engaged in conversation, so feel free to get into engage, engage. Yeah, get. I'm getting into different positions. No, don't talk to him. Right, we're gonna summon some stuff as well to help. Uh, so hold on a moment. Uh, what are we gonna summon? We're going to summon Nundead Warrior. And get your charming arrow out. Oh, that that's a, that's not a problem. Come on, give me fast here. Enhanced navigation. I suppose and I can uh Range power starts. Splintered arrow on him, there we go. Wait, that missed. Can I ricochet on him? I can't. I've just oh, gotta do a ra swordsman is gone, by the way. Yeah. I've just gotta do a regular Alright, hang on, let me summon something else. I'm going to summon a nice elemental. Okay. Okay. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> that was me charging in. That was that was pretty epic. He's flanked and knocked down. Well. See what we need to. Come on. It's all or nothing now. <laughs> okay. Uh, so I almost, uh, almost want to quick save. Almost. I'm going to get a little bit closer to you. And then... I could potentially do a charming arrow on the twins joined by fire if you want. Can you do it on Diedrich the Baron of Bones? He's too far away. Uh, how about on the ghoul that used to guard the lighthouse? Yeah, I could possibly reach him. Because I think he's probably the better target to charm. I've only got one charming arrow, though. I could also just shoot a fire arrow down and explode him. Yeah, that that's good as well. Should I do the explosive arrow or the fire arrow? Let's see. 75% chance to set burning, 100% chance to set burning. This one does almost double damage, though. Ooh, it's... That's just about going to reach. Fingers crossed. It's a bit of a stretch. That's okay. He's like a third dead. Yeah. Melee power stance. <laughs> Matora charged in just as I shot at him. That is pretty oh, funny. That took an extra. Uh, oh, that's disappointing. Uh, took fine. an extra action He's point, did it? Yeah, it said it was going to be one to move and then four to attack, but it actually ended up being two to move because he had to go around the ice elemental thing. Okay. I could throw him closer to Earthel if you want. Yes. Because this is a brilliant idea. <laughs> and then uh, bitter cold on. Can't reach anyone actually. I could try How freezing about just him. Casting rain. I, I maybe. No, I've not got enough action points. I'll save the action points. Okay, so I've got two attacks here. This is a very, oh, very tactical combat. <laughs> he's stunned as okay. well. And he's burning. Ah, oh, burning makes him healed. That's bad. One of my axes is fire. 
Um, what's this? This is a one-handed stone thing. That's the water. This is the fire axe. It's going to be two to equip it, and then we've got three. It's probably better to swap it out. There we go. It's wasted a little bit of time. But better than the other yeah. alternative. Baron of Blood. He's still just having not Ow. good time. Ziscario is very hurt. Very hurt, right. Uh, it's Bracus Rex next, by the way. Just if you've got a knockdown arrow or anything. Oh, bum. Hang on. Why have one when you can have two for twice the price? He's immune to knockdown. Ah, that's He's why. He's also stunned at the moment, so don't worry too much. If you've got a way to heal yourself, actually heal yourself, might be worth... Uh, let's... Drink those two. Okay, so it's going to be seven to get over there, five to get here. I'll go after Diedrich, I think. You can also summon Nick, remember? Not from Muley, I can't. No, no, but when it comes round to Earthville again. Oh, good hit. That was okay. Right, we're going to get regen going on Muley. Uh, on Muley? Okay. And then I'm going to try and good. freeze Diedrich. Nice. Okay. 82% chance to hit. Do you want to get Nick out or? Man, this thing is slow to attack. 100% chance to set Petrified for two turns though. It's also irreplaceable. So, uh, yes. No, if I get Nick out, that's my entire turn gone. Oh, okay. Petrified, Petrified failed. failed. Saved against. Hundred percent chance. Well, he's got sixty-one percent chance to resist. So, the sword is broken now. So I need to switch over to something else. It's like a it's a one shot thing. So. Yeah. Um. What shall I use in its stead? Probably clobbering time. There we go. Put that back on. Bye bye. Ah, oh, man, got two of us. Yeah. All right. Inventory. Resurrect scroll on Muley, I think. No. Okay. Hmm. What do you reckon? Just attack? Uh, get Nick out. It's another potential target. Yeah, but it takes my entire turn to do it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of feeling like we're just not quite strong enough. <laughs> Given this is a well-planned assault, I would be inclined to agree. I mean, we've got him down to half health. Uh-oh. Ah, she's still alive somehow. No. <laughs> Twins joined by fire are a little bit surprised that Muley is dead suddenly. We've had this happen before. It sometimes just takes them a while to realize Yeah, to, to work it out. But this is this is massively educational, if nothing else. Yes. Um
Ah, that's so much. Why is that? Oh, it's crippling. Crippled. He is knocked down though. And that's that. <laughs> that's pretty much that. <laughs> Just to add insult to injury. Uh, Would you like one more attempt at it? Yeah, all right. Let's give it one more quick go. Okay. So what I'm thinking is, if I'm careful with the summoning, let's uh, let's position the uh, uh, various summon scrolls first. So I've got two ice elemental scrolls and I've got the undead warrior scroll. So I'm going to split these and I'm going to give one to Siscario, one over here. And do you want one for Medora? Um, lock level 40. Uh, sorry, sorry, what are you doing? Ice elemental scrolls. I've got an ice elemental scroll for Siscario and um, Jason Momoa and I could give an undead warrior scroll to Medora, if you wanted. Let's have a look. I've got an air elemental scroll for Earthle. Uh, Medora doesn't have anything, so yeah, you may as well give one over. There we go. So when we're ready to go, as in when you're engaged yeah. in conversation, we'll have to summon all of them and then I'll get Siscario to attack. Okay. I suppose just let me know when you're ready. Um, right. I think you're going to have to get into position ready to start the comp- You need to start the conversation or- uh, As in whoever you want to start the conversation needs to get in there now. Here we go. Okay. Now, who do we want the ice elementals to be up by? By him? Uh, just surrounding him, I suppose. Okay. So I'll get my people forwards and I'll say when I start summoning them. Okay, I'm going to start summoning the first, then the second, then I'll go. Okay. First. Second. Oh, that's the wrong one. Oh, well, too late. Ah, one ran out. That's a shame. I spread my people far enough apart that only Siscario died. Okay, so I'm going to resurrect Siscario. Oh, Nick, sorry, you won't get a chance to see the lighthouse. That was um, uh, about 20 episodes ago. It's quite uh, a nice lighthouse, thing. And I'll keep him there, actually. That's a good place. <laughs> and we're going to get... You put him on fire, have you? Oh, no, he's all right. No, no, just, just near it. I'm going to get bitter cold on the ghoul that used to guard the lighthouse, I think. He's burning again. Yeah, that's because he's made of fire. Oh, so that's not you that did that. No, I don't think oh, so. Oh, he... Uh, yeah, that's uh, that's going to be annoying. I will get rain on him. Damage soaks are soaking damage. Air Elemental's turn. Don't know what he's going to do. Uh, I think... That. Try again. Uh, that's all the action points it had. <laughs> 
Not sure quite what to do with Earthal. Uh, That's a good call. And then uh, let's get this back out. So, foot grenade, uh, which sets diseased. On Bracus Rex, I guess. He's diseased! Okay. And he's knocked down at the moment. So. Shall I he's also at full health. <laughs> <laughs> My god. Um, let's... Yeah, if I do fast here. He is a bit far away. What's my weapon got on it? Let's have a look. Air and water. Be, be extra careful about moving because you're in the middle of fire and you yeah. have very little health. Uh, let's uh, let's go after Diedrich, I think. Failed to chill him. Okay, only sixty-six percent chance to uh, do this. It's a shame I can't cancel the melee power stance now that I'm doing it. Yes, that that is a, a bit of a shame. Oh no! Uh, Adam, I'm up to about 610-ish. Okay. Rain, rain. Rain, rain. And then I will teleport Bracus Rex. And, uh, do you want me to land him down by Earthle? Uh, yeah, that would be good. Oh, actually, I can't teleport him. I will just shocking touch on this. Stunning it. Stunned. Nice. That's going to help. So, Earthle, um, can you use this to get close? Damn it. Oh, no. I'm going to have to resurrect myself again. Yeah. Oh, right. He is still burning. Yeah, like, I think his blood is fire. It's, uh, He's not burning anymore, but yeah, it means every time we hit him. Okay, what do I have? Let's um, get this resurrection going. Oh, nice. Still healed him. It's, uh, ah, it's frustrating. Uh oh. Incoming. Oh no, horror. Oh, just fear. All right, now incoming. Ah, oh, god damn it! <laughs> <laughs> He really hates this Gario, doesn't he? It certainly seems that way. Be 
basically all Jason Momoa is doing. <laughs> Wow, he was healed twice. I thought I could do with some health. <laughs> I'll see if I can do anything about that. I mean, I'm, I'm out of... Um, resurrection scrolls. No. <laughs> <laughs> Uh. Well, I think we need to go away and uh, do some more side quests, slash, get some more fire resist gear, slash, just level up and generally be better. Yeah. Um, that's going to be all we have time for for this episode. Uh, thank you very much for watching, everyone. I hope you've enjoyed this, despite the fact that we've made very, very little progress and it's been just a long slog of us uh, dying. Banging our heads against off. the brick wall that is uh yeah <laughs> yeah uh, remember to like these videos if you like them and subscribe to our channels if you have not already and uh we shall see you next time for some more divinity original sin we'll see you soon